Hello there, this is Alistair Goodell from GT Driving School. I find myself in Seven Oaks today and I thought I'd give, uh, show you a few places around Seven Oaks. Um, the first one we're going to do is heading on the A25, heading towards the town centre, uh, towards a junction a crossroads called the Batten Ball. And we're going to be turning right at that junction. It's a little bit tricky, so I thought we'd uh, have a go and see what we can do. So first thing it is, I've just got to go move out into the road at the moment. I've got a little bit of traffic, so I'm just going to wait for them. I'm checking my mirrors, I'm checking over my right shoulder. Still a little bit of traffic, so I'm going to just keep on waiting. And we might just get through in a minute. But this is sometimes what you need to do when you're moving away from the right. You'll just need to be checking your mirrors, checking over your right shoulder. Looks good. We can move around this blue car and out onto the road. And here we go. Now this road can get quite congested at times. So it's uh, well worth sort of taking your time. You're sort of 25 to 28. Don't be surprised that uh, there's a lot of traffic. Now up ahead there's a pedestrian crossing and a bit of a crossroads where people coming from the hospital can be coming from your left and there's a, a junction on your right. There's also a keep clear in front of us. So I'm just going over the crossing, stopping at this side of the crossing and be between the crossing and the keep clear signs. Allows the grey car to move over. Now I'm not blocking the crossing and I'm not blocking the crossroads. You can just about see ahead, there's a green sign on the left hand side telling us about the junction itself. I'm going to be going towards Otford, um, but we're just waiting for traffic to clear first of all. A bit more traffic building up on the left and to the right of us. Everybody's just uh, taking their time, keeping the keeping their distance, keeping the junction clear, which is good news. Doesn't always happen like this. And being ready to go. Just looking at the brake lights of the guys in front, and as soon as they start to come off their brakes, I'll be starting to cross. But being aware of the cars left and right of me, to make sure that I don't uh, cause a problem there. Now I can see some movement up ahead, so I'm just checking around me and just going to move very gently forward. The car on the left is moving up, and the car on the right is going to stay. Now we're coming around the corner and down the hill towards the Batten Ball. Now we're going to be turning right here, so we're checking main and right. There aren't any actual lanes, but I'm going to keep more towards the right and aim to go over that white arrow. Now I've got to look ahead, looking at the red car, thinking of whether it's coming through or not, and the black one. Now the white car is turning off, so that's okay. But after the black car, I can move round, and anybody that's on the on our left-hand side would have to wait for me. And we'll carry on round. 